Laura, it's time to come on out. We got about 15 minutes. Laura, you can't fake being sick because you want to stay home. You can't stay home alone, and I have to go to work. So daycare is the only option, okay? Okay? I don't want to go there. Laura, you're only going to be at daycare for a few hours. You got this. No sweat. Okay? Don't hurt me for see mom. I don't ever want to go back. What? Wait a minute. You said somebody's going to hurt you? Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Listen, I won't make you go back there, okay? But you have to promise to tell me who's been up there hurting you, okay? It was Miss Price and other teachers, Mom. They hit and bully all the kids they don't like or that are different. They starve us too. I don't mm, want to go no. back there. Please don't make me. Oh my God. Okay, listen. We're gonna go back there to get to the bottom of this, but I promise you, nobody's gonna hurt you, okay? Nobody. Come here, baby, I'm so sorry. Okay, listen, go put your shoes on, cause we got to go, okay? I gotta have a talk with Miss Price. She's not gonna be touching on my baby. Come on, let's get them shoes on. We gotta go. I'm gonna call the police, I'm gonna show out today. Let's go. Come on, baby, nobody's gonna hurt you. No one. Miss Price, I'm gonna go home. You shut up! And you, you got blue all over yourself. Idiot, I told you to stop touching it! Why you lay one hand on her? How dare you talk and treat these kids this way? Who are you? What are you doing in my daycare? Oh, you better find out who I am today. I'm Laura's mother, and I'm gonna call the cops on this whole facility. No, you're not. Give me this phone. Give me some Give me that That's her officer. She's the one who's been putting her hands all over my daughter and was about to do it again and over some glue. I know because I put her baby monitor in her bag and I just heard the whole thing. Thank God, because I was just about to call the police. All of you, get out of here! Ma'am. We've had many complaints about this daycare and kids going home bruised. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. You are under arrest. Kids, by the way, your parents are going to be caught in just a second. Let's go. Thank you so much for calling the police. That woman was hurting my child, and I would have never known had she not told me. My daughter tried to tell me what was going on, but I didn't listen. Mm. But then when she came home with bruises on her, I knew there was something wrong. Oh my God. I just wish I would have paid attention sooner. Mm. Look, she's gone now, so that's all that matters. We gotta start listening to our kids, because they know what's going on before we do. Come here, sweetie. You okay? Laura, come on, baby. Come on. I told you Mama was going to take care of you. Okay. Love you. The moral of the story is pay attention to your kids' body language and emotional changes. Be wary of those involved in your child's day to day life. <laughs>